Hi, my name is Stuart Eversoll. I'm a Philadelphia native. I'm currently on tour across the United States, Canada, and Europe doing uh, photography and interviews with people with that black flag tattoos uh, for a book called Bard for Life. We are at the lovely Jughead's Bar here in Phoenix, Arizona. The notorious Los Angeles uh, black flag band is playing tonight. Seven or eight bucks to get in, two or three bands playing, and if you have a black flag tattoo, you just show up, we take pictures of you, and you end up in a book. Part for Life is a photo documentary about people with black flag tattoos, about the band Black Flag, about the scene that it created, about the furor that it created in the early 1980s and how it sort of changed my life and the life of thousands and thousands and thousands of other people. It encompasses people from ages 18 all the way up to age 50. We have everybody from gutter punks to college professors. I think the British punks had the circle A, you know, the whole anarchy thing. And I mean, it's pretty straightforward. A big circle with an A in the middle. In America, the black flag has historically been the anarchist symbol. It's four bars offset just a little bit, representative of a waving flag, but it's very stylized, very linear. Uh, very easy to replicate with the spray paint on a wall, a uh, pencil on the back of a notebook, sharpie marker on the back of a jacket. It's become American hardcore circle A, if, if I might be so bold to say so. The story to me is that the bars represent this idea that I can be a social force. My very first album was the Jealous Again EP. It was kind of like, holy shit, what is this? Then on the second listen, it's like, oh, I know what this is. This is the soundtrack to my fucked up life. This band inspired me to go across the country and across the world and document people who are just like me. And it kind of gives you a warm, fuzzy feeling that you are not alone.